Okay, well, I thought I'd take another shot at this Agnos program and um, ask the guys on the sprayer forum about how the aim works. And they you still use individual sections, like a five section or six section, whatever. Um, but they claim the nozzle control, and that's for turning, where you can just individual nozzles. But what they use is they use a meter or a meter and a half as a point in the field and if you pass over that point even if you catch a little corner like a little corner then that is considered sprayed so they need an overlap of about 60 inches so it doesn't sound exactly pinpoint sharp or their sharpshooter system but um, what I thought is if we took an 80 foot sprayer like this and it's got 48 nozzles and you make 12 sections which is plain you have four nozzles per section so you would need two drivers per so two pulse width modulated drivers per section, and so you'd have uh, two and two. So you'd have only 24 drive, pulse width modulated drivers. Then you could still do turn compensation, rate compensation based on turn, because we already do that with the look ahead. So that's pretty easy. And so then we've added six buttons that now control two of these sections together. So now you have six sections and 12 subsections. So everything works like Ag Open GPS. So you can still do the auto and the manual and all that stuff. And when you whip around and when you recover, then uh, it just turns off. Anytime a balloon goes backwards, it shuts off. That's the same as the other application. And of course, all the uh, all the 12 sections now still have okay, smart enough to know still can turn on and off in your normal section control so uh, that works pretty cool and like I say it would greatly simplified so you have the accuracy of Ag Open GPS section control right down to four inches um, and you could add pulse width modulation. And pulse width modulation to do rather than flow control is much easier to do because now you just set your pressure and then you base your pulse width modulation on your desired flow rate. Um, so I think this has some possibility. Anyway, um, looking forward to some discussion on that. Um, I know that it doesn't line up on the boom pivot points and no sprayer has six sections exactly. But that doesn't matter because you can change the size. And um, anyway, it works. It seems to work pretty good. So cool.